All right, we are back with the Lionel Messi player career mode. So in this episode, we are submitting a transfer request. We're going to enter the January transfer window and Messi might be on the move. He might be. It really depends on what kind of teams come in for Messi too, though. But we're going to submit the transfer request in this episode. And I mean, so far, 14 games in, six goals and two assists for Messi. Not as good as we'd like, but still not bad. But it might be time for Messi to move to Europe. But once again, you guys have shown crazy support on this series. So as long as we keep it up, you will keep seeing more of uh, the Lionel Messi player career mode. So once again, keep trying to aim for a thousand likes each episode of course let's know you guys want to see more of it and also we're at like 49,000 subs now so we're only a thousand away from 50k which is which is mind-blowing it's crazy that we're this close so also the sub button down below if you have not all right so we're gonna do a press conference for this episode you guys let me know in the comments though do you guys think we should do press conferences for the player crew modes or should we just jump straight into the action and skip the press conference you guys let me know in the comments we'll do one for this episode see what you guys think but first to comment say to increase Messi's balance and agility definitely something I think we should do I think we should get the links and the and uh, what's this one? The Maestro, right? Yeah, we probably should get both of these archetypes at some point. Definitely agility and balance is going to be a focus, I think. We should we should save skill points for that. And the next one, go to a team in England, Italy, or Germany as he hasn't played in those countries. Yeah, I mean, we're on console, so it's not like we can mod the game and control which team we go to. It's pretty much up to the game. I would like to move to a country Messi's never played in. I would like to do that, though. So we're going to request a transfer and just see what teams come in from. It's up to the game at this point. And the last comment, the camera angle is pretty decent. I think you should keep it for the series. Yeah, I see a lot of comments about the camera. I see a lot of them. I I, I see the the controversy now the pro camera is hard it's harder to play on I'm still I'm still not used to it and I see a lot of comments saying we should change it back to the default camera which later on we could but for now I think we should try and stick with the pro camera because I think it makes the game feel so much different like if we go back to the default camera I feel like it's gonna be boring I feel like the po the pro camera kind of adds something new to the series plus pretty much all like the big player crew modes on YouTube all use the pro camera so I think generally people like it better for uh for player crew modes but we can always change it we'll see that is uh, it's an open it's an open conversation all right so November 9th, we're going to request a transfer, even though we still got some time before January, but we're going to do it early to make sure we can actually uh, get it accepted. So officially, Lionel Messi has requested a transfer away from his uh, Argentinian boyhood club. And of course, it's been turned down. So we got to keep doing it until he accepts it. All right. So second time of the charm, I consider your request for transfer and decided in the best interest of the club to make you available. You'll be added to the transfer list immediately. All right. So now it's just up to teams. Who wants Messi? Who's going to win the Messi sweepstakes? We're going to find out, but we still got some time before the window actually opens. All right. So first game, we're going to sim this one. It is against Huracan. The way from home team has not played great in this uh, first season so far, but that's a 1-0 win. And Messi got a 6.9 rating. All right, so we have received already a transfer offer. I didn't think we'd get one so quick, but a team has approached News Old Boys for Messi, and it's a, it's a very interesting team. The team that have approached for Messi is Borussia Dortmund have approached Messi for 56.8 million man that the first one the very first one we got is Dortmund that is an extremely interesting offer I mean of course Dortmund are known for buying like younger up-and-coming players and then selling them and of course they probably still have Holland there like oh man I wanted to see a few offers come by so we could really get a feel of what teams are in for them but that we haven't even played a game yet that came in so early we're at November 24th man it's it's the first offer and I really feel like it's it's a beautiful offer we get to go to Germany play in a league that Messi has never played in and honestly in today's world it makes sense if there was a player like Messi in Argentina at 17 with this high potential Dortmund would 1000% be a team interested in a player like Messi because they can promise him first time or first team playing first team playtime is what I'm saying and the potential of an Erling Holland and Lionel Messi partnership striker right wing that just sounds like absolutely amazing so very first offer I mean, it it's almost feels like it's meant to happen in this series. So in real life, Messi left his boyhood club for Barcelona. In this universe, Messi is leaving his boyhood club for Borussia Dortmund and going to Germany. Messi is signing on the dotted line. That is contract accepted. I think that's probably one of the one of the best teams that could have came in for Messi at this point. So of course, the window's not open yet. So we finish these two months and then we'll go to Dortmund in January. So our agent says, I advise you work hard. In the meantime, I'm sure your man, new manager will be delighted by any show good form ahead of you joining the club. All right. That is extremely exciting, but we got to play one more game with uh, New Old Boys. We have a send-off game for Lionel Messi. We got two games to sim. First game is going to be, it's going to be a 2-2 two -two draw. Messi scored, though. He got a 8.5. And then last, sim game against, uh, is that Cologne? I don't know how you pronounce that, but it's going to be a 3-1 loss. And Fernando scored. Messi got a yellow. And he got a 6.1 rating. All right, we got one more game before January. We're going to play this. See if we can get a win in Messi's last game in Argentina. Oh, yeah. Also, without Messi being in the game, how did Mbappe not win player of the year? Salah 
one player of the year, the Ballon d'Or. That's uh, that's very interesting. It always goes to Mbappe. We all know that. But we got four more skill points. I want to get his agility up for sure, one thousand percent. So we're gonna do two into agility, and then let's do let's do a bit more pace. Why not? We gotta make Messi OP at this point. Like we're making him a little speed demon. But man, I am so excited. Messi's gonna be playing with Holland. It's gonna be so cool. But a send off game for Argentina's biggest prospect, maybe second biggest, Pine Alvarez at this point, because I feel like he might be playing a little bit better than us. But one last game for news old boys and yeah you guys probably noticed we're playing on legendary i feel like ultimate player crew mode it's just uh it's a bit too much we also changed messi's hairstyle i also did that i forgot to mention that game a uh, new pair of boots too um let's avoid losing let's actually uh let's actually get a win let's enhance it for a win but messi's final game in argentina can we have a good send off can we score a goal can we assist we're gonna see what we can do because this man is about to go to a foreign land an absolute foreign land can you imagine going from going from argentina to germany as as a 17 year old that's just uh it's pretty pretty nuts and hey maybe in this reality dorbin get, didn't get knocked out of the champions league maybe we're still in the champions league and we can play in the knockout stage and the really good thing about that dorbin it's a team you know they get a player like holland maybe a season or two he's there and then he leaves i feel like we're probably gonna have a similar story at Dortmund. Like, it's definitely not a long-term team that we're going to stay at for a while, I think. All right, Mendez, this is our last game together. I want you to put in a good performance, being my right-back partnership. Oh, that's a good ball. Messi. Messi has room here. Messi. Messi is absolutely almost taken out. That should have been a foul right there. I would have went down if I was Messi there. Once again, I keep wanting to take finesse shots of Messi, but his finesse shots are just so bad. I'm not sure if there's a trade for that or what, but I feel like from distance, I probably should stop taking uh, finesse shots. All right, that is a decent ball. Get it to Mendez. And the striker was making a very good run. But Mendez, I need a better ball than that. I'm also looking forward to playing with a much better team. Because this team, uh, they're not amazing. Uh, that's that's putting it kindly. We're also going to be playing in a much tougher league, though. But it's also that. I mean, we can't even do anything in this game. Our team is not having the ball. I feel like it's been all all them. But I also wonder what formation Dortmund is currently playing with in FIFA. Because if it's a, not a winger formation and they have a cam, we can maybe move Messi to cam. Because I feel like if he's not playing right wing... That's probably the second best spot. What is that? I did not even... I, I called for that, but that's no way that can be towards Messi. That, what kind of ball was that? Okay, for once in our life, there is some space here. Give it to the striker. Beautiful. Beautiful Messi to me. And oh, they should have played it to Messi. Now they're going to try to, and it's just too late. Okay, wait. We're, we're here. I'm here. I'm here in space. I'm here in space. I'm here. Oh, I'm right here. I'm right here. Oh, I called for the pass. I called for it right when he played it. I could have shot there. Bro, that's the most infuriating thing about player crew mode. When you call for a pass, when they pass it to you. All right, we're, we're taking the corner at least. Uh, let's do like a near post and try to fizz it in. All right, no one. We weren't on the same page there. No one went towards it. I mean, it's fine. Messi's going to take the shot though. Okay, it's going to be blocked. Oh, 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 he's offside. That looks pretty good, but... He's offside. We got 30 minutes to make something happen. That's like our first actual like attack of the game, I think. Because we've just been sitting back letting this team just pass it around. Like I'm trying to preserve a little bit of stamina, but we got to press these players. Oh, Messi could be in here. Can we play it to the striker maybe? Play it to the striker. Beautiful. Rasco, he is going to lose it though. I Okay, in a week's time, we'll be playing with much better players. So we just got to stay calm. Okay, this is decent. This is very decent. We're, we're in a weird spot though. Get it to Messi. Oh, just, he can't get it to us in a good spot. The one chance we had in the game, of course, I called for it right when he played it to us, and then we just played it back to him. Okay, this is a chance. This is a chance. Messi to possibly score the winner in his last game. The keeper makes another great save. How do we not score that? That was a chance for a winner. That was our chance, and the keeper just saves it. Oh, that is absolutely heartbreaking. We're going to loft this one in. Can we get something? Can we get something? Nope, we're not going to. And that is going to be full time. That is Messi's final game. Oh, we had a beautiful chance there to just get the winner in his last game, but it's going to be a draw. We didn't play terrible. The team, we barely had the ball. Like, I am so sick of this team. So, not not as, not as best game, not as worst. Pretty much sums up his time at New's Old Boys, but it's time for a completely new, new journey. All right, officially making the move to the Bundesliga. Making the move to Germany, and here we go. R. Look at Leo and his new kit. It looks absolutely very weird. All right, we're going to go number 30 at Dortmund, I think, especially if no one else has that. So from Argentina to Europe and early Holland, of course, is still here. Beautiful. So of course, the window just opened, so they don't really have any signings yet. I guess we're the first signing. But man, Leo Messi in in Germany. It is uh, it is something special. Is this Erling Holland Messi partnership going to actually work? So we currently sit in fourth, uh, nine points behind Bayern. So I mean, it's pretty much realistic, I guess. But in the Champions League, Dortmund are 
Did we finish in the group? Did we actually finish in? Wait, what are what are these Champions League groups? Wait, what? Like, I, I'm sorry. Why are Leeds in the uh, in the in the Champions League? Like, what are these groups? These are not the real groups. I definitely when I when I start the series, I always go to the Champions League groups. I made I didn't change at all. Like Venezia are in the Champions League. Like what? I don't know if somehow we start in Argentina. So when we move to Germany. The game has to load up all the Champions League. If something went wrong there and they randomized it, well, we are not in the Champions League. Um, are we in the Europa League? At least. Uh, yes, we are. Okay, that makes sense. Barcelona are too. So how did they replicate this to make it realistic? Like, I am very, I'm very confused on why Barcelona are in a, uh, and we are because it's realistic, but also very weird. But all right, so we're in the Europa League. I mean, it's good enough. So Malin and Holland are doing their things 13 and 12. Honestly, they might play with like a cam formation. So we might move to cam. We will, we'll see though. So I've only been here like a few days, but it's already time for our Borussia Dortmund debut. Messi's debut. We're facing Frankfurt away from home. So, I mean, we could maybe catch Bayern Munich if they uh, have a collapse, but I think our goal should be to finish second at the very least. So 58th minute game is nil nil. We're coming on at right wing. So I guess they do play with uh, with a winger formation. And Holland got a red card in the 55th minute. So Holland gets a red we're playing with 10 men and the manager takes off Emery Chan and puts Messi on I mean hey we'll see so we don't get to play with Holland but nonetheless we make our Borussia Dortmund debut let's see it one of the biggest prospects in the world gone from Argentina to Germany Messi is in Germany in the Bundesliga and we're making our debut um let's say we can get a 7.0 rating we should get that all right it is a rainy after not afternoon it's probably a nighttime game obviously a nighttime game what am i saying well let's try to have a good debut i mean we're down to 10 men though this is gonna be a little bit a little bit weird but hey we're playing with much better players so hopefully i expect better but we are facing better players at the same time though i just have no idea what formation we're even playing so we'll have to we'll have to figure that out okay wait holland is on the field was that not a red card i saw w was i looking at something else holland is actually on the field i'm very confused i don't know what i saw that was red it, it looked like a red card maybe i'm wrong but okay uh, Holland is in the field. We're actually playing with Holland. I didn't even notice that. I am very, very confused. Here, we are drifting after this free kick. I mean, we're right here. Holland, where are you at? Holland. Okay, that's gonna work. That works. Hazard. Get it back to us. Holland into Messi. Into Messi. Messi debut goal. Messi debut goal for Borussia Dortmund. And it was assisted by Erling Holland. I think this partnership is about to be something special. Like 15 minutes into his debut, he's already scored a goal in Germany. Holland. Plays the ball. Messi's in left foot. It is just, it's beautiful. Hopefully the first of many here in Germany. That is how you debut for your new team though. Five goals in six games. Uh, what? What is that stat? We, this, is, this is our first game. Hey, that's perfect though. Let's win this game now. All right, Holland, your time. Your time now. Oh, that's going to be an attempted. Oh, we actually, that actually got to him. What was the whistle? Was it a foul on Holland? How did, how was it a foul on Holland? Maybe, maybe he uh, handled the ball. Cause how is that a how is that a foul? All right, Holland to Leo. Oh, oh, is that a foul? How is that not a foul? He just pulled us. Ref. Oh, we can steal that. Oh, I thought they were gonna steal that. How is that not a foul? That man just pulled us. Oh, don't score. They're gonna score. Okay, this is tied up in the 75th minute. Man, how did they not call that? We're about to run right past the defender and he just holds his shoulder. All right, we got 15 minutes to try and score the winner now. All right, Holland gets it to Wolf. Holland, we're in a good space here. Wolf, just play it to us. Give it to us, Holland, go on a run. Holland, all right, I want to get to Wolf. How do we not get it to Wolf? How do we not play that? Yeah, this is another good chance. Holland, get it to Holland. Just hold it up for us, big man. Okay, play it to Messi now. Messi on the right wing, picks it up. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? All right, okay, someone run in the space. Okay, Royce, beautiful. We're here, we're here, we're here. Give it to Holland. Oh, we should have gotten a better spot there. He should have, he should have just kept his run going. Messi gets it to... Bellingham into, is that Hazard? That was great passing though. I think it was a good save, but that, that was great passing right there. So corner sent in. We are the man outside the box. Which I'm not against. Give it to us. Give it to us. So give us the ball. Give us the ball. Give us the ball. There we go. Messi volley. Oh, I've off the crossbar. Look at that would have been like the best goal if you scored. Okay, we're going to, oh, Messi, what a turn. What a turn. Just can't quite get to it. Messi from distance just hit the crossbar. That would have been such a good winner. Oh, I can't believe that. How unlucky is that? What a shot from Messi. We hit the crossbar. All right, we believe. We believe. We believe Holland could be in here. Holland, I think you're in, bud. Holland's in. No, why would he pass it? Oh, he just got taken out, though. He just got absolutely taken out. He should have ran and took it himself. He had the pace there. It's going to be a red. He should have just went and scored, though. Could have been an assist. All right, we got a free kick, and Holland's, uh, he's taking this, apparently. All right, we'll see what uh, see what the boy can do. It's very close, but I believe in Erling Holland. Erling Holland, 
that is gonna be oh it's gonna be over the net it skimmed the roofing of the net but man he was in all he had to do was just run straight just sprint he could have shot from there maybe and man they're gonna get the last attack huh yeah we oh man holland could have been in there too so we scored but we hit the crossbar holland should have taken that chance we got very close to winning the game but still a very eventful and we scored on our debut messi scored so i mean can't be too mad with that we'll get another look at messi's first goal in germany assisted by of course erling holland Hopefully we see a lot more of those. All right, so we are a sub, but apparently we're not playing in this in this Freiburg game at all. So uh, we're just gonna sim it. Messi did not play this game. It's gonna be a four-one win though. That's good to see. All right, next game is uh, it's Hoffenheim, and if you look at the bottom right, Messi's starting at right back. Um, I'm very unsure what's happening. I'm not playing a right back though. We're gonna sim this. So Messi's first start. We're playing at right back though. It's so weird. It's gonna it's gonna be a one-nil win though. Messi did score. So hey, that's not bad. Messi got an eight point nine rating that game. So two great two games played and two goals for Messi so far. Also secured the dub there. So that's a, that's a pretty good game. I don't know why we're playing right back though. I don't know why. All right. So transfer to the day is gone and passed. So we sold Brandt, Hummels, and Hits. And we brought in Kirk, Kirkes, and Spinazzola. So that's the moves Dortmund have made. I mean, missing Hummels kind of sucks. But we got Zagadu, Kanji. So I think we'll be fine. But that is the transfer window. Uh, complete. What is, who is the player we signed, though? Okay, we, we sold hits, but he's still here. Um, Spinozola's here. And then the Kirkes guy was another left back. I'm not sure how we signed him. But Hummels is st still here. Uh, joining Barcelona when the transfer window opens. The game is a little bit glitchy, not gonna lie. But not that many moves, so that's good. Still got the Messi, still got the Holland partnership. I'm hopefully hoping Holland stays. Because if he left, that would suck. All right, next game, we are facing Leverkusen. Messi's still right. Why, why are we playing? Okay, do we not have a right back, maybe? Like, why are we playing right back? Is this team, do we not have a right back? That's my only explanation. No, we have more near and Mori. Why are we playing right back? It makes zero sense. I feel like this happened before, and what we did to fix it was, did we change positions, maybe, I think? It's a 4-3-3, though. Like Emery Chan is playing in a right wing spot. Why aren't we playing there? It makes absolutely zero sense. But okay, we're gonna we're gonna play this, but we're gonna basically pretend we're we're gonna try to play both right wing and right back. We'll, we'll maybe try to change position to maybe like right mid or something. See if that fixes it. We can try that. But it's our first uh, home played game. Can you imagine signing Messi and then playing at right back? Dortmund, what do you what are you guys on? We're gonna pretend he's playing right mid, where he's gotta defend a little bit, but he's also gonna bomb forward. Uh let's say eight point five. Let's enhance that one. But okay, what is his camera? Okay, there we go. We're playing right wing. We're playing right mid. I'm gonna say we're we're, saying pro, we're a wing back. Still gonna try to do our thing, but hey, scored two and two so far. So we'll see if we can keep it up. We're gonna get out of position a lot, but honestly, I just don't care. I don't care right now. Holland, drag the defender. He drags him. Oh, this defender stayed with us so well, though. He tracked us so well there. Okay, we should have did a little bit better with that. Oh, that's a bad touch. All right, Messi, what do we got? Get it to Witzel. Fitzel gets it to Holland. Messi could be in here. That needed to be a better ball. That should have been a clear chance right there. Emre Chan through to Messi. Good first touch. Play it to Holland. Holland is at our first assist. Holland can't finish the chance though. That was so perfect. He has a one on one. The keeper came out for it pretty well, I guess. Hey, that's the that's the Messi Holland partnership though. That is a corner sent in. That is going to be it's a very very big clearance. All right, we're drifting here. We're drifting. We're drifting. Bellingham into Messi. First time, oh, we took a good touch. The shot just goes wide. We did decent there. We got the ball on our right foot away from the defender, but that is, uh, that's, it's a very off target shot. Oh God, if they can see it, it's not gonna be our fault. It's their fault for playing us at right back. If they, if, if we can see it, it's not our fault. I will not take blame for us conceding. Okay, play that down the wing. Cause there's some space here. We're drifting, but I like it. Bellingham, oh, could have played it to us. Okay, there's us and Holland, 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 Holland. Oh, I just wanted that to be more to the left of the defender. Witzel, Messi, I think Holland was offside there. Okay, let's hold it up. Give it to Witzel. Work it around, work it around. That's not working it around. I don't know what that was, but Messi, long shot. Oh, just, did that hit the, I think that hit like the post behind the net. That was a decent shot, man. We need to get, we need to get these on target though. All right, we got one minute, but we got some room here maybe. Oh, there's the room, there's the room. Okay, not exactly, Holland's behind us. Give it back to us. He gives it back to us. Messi in front of goal. Was he offside? The the ref blew the whistle so quick. He must have been offside because that would have been a corner. How are we offside there? We missed it anyways, but man, we got to finish these chances. We got like 82 finishing, so it. We, I mean, I don't know how we're not getting better shots on goal, but hey, it's been a good game. Just nothing to show for it yet. That was a foul. Call that, please. We played well. Just uh, no goal to show for it just yet. All right, Royce, Witzel, Holland. Get it to okay, get it get it back. Oh, I thought that was gonna go to Royce. I didn't think that was gonna go all the way to us. All right, Holland gets it to Messi. Get it back to okay. What was that? Okay, that works. We keep it. I didn't I didn't plan for that, but it works. 
Messi. Okay, that was a bad, that was a bad ball from Holland. That put us in a bad spot. Oh, we got space here again. Get it to Emery Chan, the right back apparently. Royce, back to Holland. Oh, that should have been back to Holland. Emery Chan. Oh, just play it back to us. How do we not get the how do we not get the ball there? Oh, they're gonna score now. They're gonna score now. No, Cobble makes a save. All right, so we got a new position, right wing. So I guess they brought on. Maybe we change formation. Now we look like we're playing a three at the back formation. But hey, at least we're right wing, so I could be happy about that. This game, we've, we've played decent as a team. Just no goal to show for it. That could change, though. Holland, are you going to be in? Please be onside. Please be onside. Holland is offside. I need him to just be onside there. Just hold up your run just a little bit. Yeah, that's a great steal by the hoot. Holland, play it to my seat. Oh, that's not the ball I wanted. Okay, that works. This works. This totally works. Holland, Royce, in to Leo. Leo, right-footed shot into the back of the net potentially the winner in this game and Messi has scored in every single game he's played so far for Borussia Dortmund. Finally, the goal we deserve. We've played so good in this game as a team. Finally, it's a clear chance and Messi will finish that chance. And Messi had a very good start to life in Germany. A very, very good start. Yeah, I mean, even though we played right back for most of this game, we still got a lot of chances. So we basically could play as like a right wing slash right back. Although the, the amount of out of positions we get in this game are probably going to be like 40. Yeah, we've switched to a 4 uh, a 3 4 3 actually. Honestly, this is probably a really good formation to use. I'm surprised Norman don't play this normally in the game. All right, keep the lead, please. Please, please keep the lead. That's a block. It's a volley. It's another block by Emery Chan. We survive and we keep the lead. Okay, Holland. It's just me and you, bud. Oh, play it to us. Play it. Oh, Holland. I called for that. Okay, we still have this. What is happening? Oh, Royce, Royce. Oh, I called for that. I wanted him to just get it. I wanted to get him way into the right there. Oh, no. Okay, don't score off this. Kanji, that is beautiful defending. Let's just keep this. Oh, what was that pass? All right. Doesn't matter. 81st minute Messi's goal is actually the winner in this game. It was a very good game. We could have had like maybe two or three goals in this game ourselves. But hey, it's a win. Another game. Another goal for Messi. It has been a very, very good start for us at Borussia Dortmund. All right, we got eight more skill points. So I think I definitely want the Lynx archetype. That gets his agility up to 90 and 85. And uh, let's get some, let's get some, what should, we, what should we do here? I would like the sniper archetype because then we can do uh, free kicks. So I guess let's, let's put some into that. And uh, we've neglected passing a little bit because I feel like our passing is pretty decent. It's not terrible. But we'll do a little bit more in short and long passing though. All right, next game is Union Berlin. A manager is still playing as a right back, but we're going to sim this away from home. Messi scored in every single game so far, and it's going to be a 2-1 loss this time around. Holland scored, but uh, we take the loss. Messi got a 5.4. Definitely, definitely not our best game. Look at that. Lionel Messi, a welcome bonus. There's a new name being chanted by the fans at Dortmund. Uh, Lionel Messi really stepped up on the mark and put in some big performances in recent games. Now we got to the Europa League preliminary round. Uh, first leg against Nantes. Nantes. Um, let's sim the home leg and play the, the second leg, I think. So first leg, Messi's still at right back for some, for whatever reason. This is going to be, it's going to be a 1-1 one -one draw. Okay, we got a lot of work to do in the, the second leg. Messi got a 5.8. He's not a right back, so it's not a big surprise. All right, Bracey Morching glad back. Messi's still a right back. I think in the next episode, we'll try and change positions. I want to start for the Europa League, so we're probably going to do that next. But uh, that's a 4 0 win. And Messi got a 10.0, although we did not score. So I'm guessing Messi assist assisted some there. All right, second leg versus Nantes. Let's try and uh, it's not, let's not get knocked out of the Europa League. So you're looking to do. We got we to gotta advance in the Europa League at the very least. We can't be like Dortmund in real life. I do feel like we're playing much better with uh, this Dortmund team. Obviously, it's a much better team. I feel like we hold the ball so much better. And they find us in much more dangerous positions. All right, Bellingham, good ball out to Hazard. Get it back to Bellingham. Messi's right here. Messi's right here. Oh, that defender just went at us. Bellingham gets it to Messi. Messi, Messi, room for the shot. That's going to be blocked, though. All right, we got the ball in a good spot. It's going to be Emery Chan playing right wing. It makes no sense. Holland could be in, though. Holland could be in. Oh, he was in. Was he offside there? I don't, I don't think he was. That looked very awkward. He tried to, like, hit it. On the pass. All right, work it around. Holland. That was a that was a little uh, good little back heel there. Whatever it was, gonna find Holland. Bellingham gives it to Messi. Get it back to Bellingham. Okay, get it back to Bellingham. Get it back to Bellingham. There we go. Holland. Holland. We're making our run. Bellingham. Bellingham. Oh, we were in a good spot. Hazard. Back to Leo. Leo. Oh, it's gonna be right at the defender. And we're getting into some very good spots though. That's an opportunity to shoot. Holland. Holland goes for the shot and he puts it wide. All right, we're getting we're getting some good chances though. Can't be angry with this. Okay, Emery Chan, go on a run, buddy. You're playing right wing. Go on a run. Thank you, thank you. Now get it back to us. Beautiful, but beautiful, Messi. All oh, beautiful dribbling. Get it to Guerrero. Guerrero, long shot. Hey, that was a that was a decent attempt. We are all over them though. Absolutely all over them. Messi. Okay, I keep taking shots from there and they keep getting blocked. We're gonna keep trying though. We're much better than this team, so it should be all us and it is right now. Holland gives it to us. 
Oh, I'll just keep it. Okay, that works. Back to us. Back to us. Get it to Hazard Holland. To oh, what a ball! Oh, that was almost a very good ball from Holland. Good ball. Good ball. I like the movement. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Get it to oh, get it. To, I called for it again right when they gave it to me. Okay, this looks good. Holland, you could be in. You should be in. Holland is in. We're gonna tell him to shoot. Oh, it was a good shot. Keeper makes save though. Holland needs to score. We've set him up now maybe two or three times with some very good chances he's not scored yet. That is a lofted corner in. And that is very awkward, but how does that get all the way to them? And Bitzel just played it off. Played it off their player. Now we're a right back and we have to track all the way back. This is like the definition of being all over a team, though. We are swarming them. Holland. Holland's shot is blocked. It's going to fall to Leo. It's going to be a shot. It's also blocked. Man, they're just defending with their life right now. And that is halftime. What's funny is that, like, I'm not in the right back spot at all like Emery Chan is. But it's not telling us we're out of position. It's like the game knows. And Emery Chan is kind of tracking back to be... He's probably got a defensive work rate thing there. Oh, that's a that's a bad chance. Koble, good save. Right, we're helping out a bit. We're helping out a bit. Oh, what is that touch? What was that? And yeah, we're helping out, though. Oh, Messi, what a tackle. Get that, Emery Chan. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, I didn't, I didn't call for that. And you know what? We keep it. It doesn't matter. Get Messi doing some defensive work, though. All right, Holland. Good ball to Emery Chan. Give it back to us. Give it back to us. Emery Chan. Give it back. Give it back. Give it back. There we go. There we go. Let's work this around. In to Axel Witzel. Witzel. Oh, this is movement. This is good movement. Find us. They found us. Oh, I can't get room for a shot, though. I'm sick of these shots getting blocked. So I'm trying to find a good uh, good angle there. All right, Witzel into Messi. Holland, you're making a bit of a decent run. Okay, that was overhead a bit. It was overhead. Messi, yeah, Holland actually almost got to that. We should win that. We do. Messi from distance. It's always blocked. Every shot is just blocked. I am so sick of every shot being blocked. Oh, we can maybe win this. Oh, we do win it. Oh, is it off them? Oh, that's off us. That is so unfortunate. All right, we need to change the formation to the 3-4-3. The three, three. Hopefully, the manager does that soon. Holland to Dahoud. Hazard tries to get to Holland, but it's not going to reach him. Oh, no, 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 no. Did they score? They actually scored. Okay. Maybe this is going to be a little bit too realistic because we might get knocked out of the Europa League. Okay, that's a good ball. Messi, long shot. Keeper makes a save. Rebound, rebound, rebound. It's going to go out for a corner. Okay, 3-4-3, three, three, I think. The manager has switched the formation. That's going to be a clearance out to Leo. Okay, it's not. Why did the game not give me the ball? Emery Chan to Leo on his left foot. It's going to be too much power. Okay, we need, to, we need to score. Otherwise, this series might be a little bit too realistic. Oh, we got a chance. We got a chance. Messi breaks free. Left foot. Oh, Messi puts it into the back of the net. This game is all tied up. Yeah, we're playing much better with a better team. It makes so much sense. Messi is scoring a decent amount of goals. It was a good little pickup by Holland. A very good ball to Messi. Held off the defender. Got the pace and dribbling. And then just a little left foot finish. That looks like a Messi finish right there. Okay, we have a chance. 2-2. Two, two. This could go to extra time. Or we could score the winner, which that would be preferably what happens. All right, let's work this around. Get that to Guerrero. Uh, the who's playing on the right? I don't know why. I like this. I like it. Okay, Holland jumped over that. Left it for us. Uh, Holland's deferring to us. You know what that means? This is Leo's team. Oh, it's going to be blocked. It's going to be actually saved. Holland's deferring to us, though. He's, he's saying, hey, Messi, you're the man of this team now. You're scoring the goals. You're hot. I'm going to I'm gonna let the ball go to you. It's a corner, though. It's a corner. That is going to be... That's going to be an awkward, awkward clearance. It's going to get to Leo, though. I mean, from distance, why not? I mean, they're, they're getting off of us. You know what, Messi? All the way? Although, oh, it's not enough stamina for that. I thought he did. They were just laying off of him. That was so weird. All right, two minutes at a time. We still got time here for a chance. We definitely do. Give it to Messi. There it is. We got a chance. Can we find Holland? Can we find Holland? Can we find Holland? We dragged it back all the way to Royce. Royce, okay, we're back. We're back. We're back in the mix. Gets it to Messi. Messi, oh, we just can't get it to Holland. There's just no space. Okay, we're going into uh, extra time. All right, honestly, we, we we're playing good enough where we should win this in extra time. Messi has a chance, and the keeper makes another good save. Keepers in this game are a little... Even on legendary, keepers are still just insane. That's a clearance, and... Oh, I wanted the ball there. I really wanted it. Oh, still gonna get it, though. Malin gets it to Messi, into Emre Chan, into Royce, and Marco Royce scores the go-ahead goal for Borussia Dortmund. All right, let's 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 win this. I want to go on a Europa League little run. We can win it. We have, we have a chance to win it with the team we have. Well, I don't want to get knocked out in the first round. Oh, that's an interesting steal. I think Malin's on for Holland. He must have been a uh, must have been a little bit rinsed. Oh, that that dribbling was nice. That was pretty nice. Okay, Malin, you got you got the pace. Flip it up to Malin. Volley attempt rebound. Oh, what a good ball from Messi. That was a beautiful pass. That could have been like the assist of the season if he actually scored that. All right, 15 more minutes. We got a one goal lead. Let's just wrap this up and make it to at least the round of 16 of the, of the Europa League. Because you know that that would be nice. Malin. Into Leo. Leo got a chance to seal this game. 
He's got a chance to seal it. We went for the low driven shot. These keepers are insane. They just absolutely save everything. A really good chance. Maybe we don't, maybe we don't got the stamina for a really good shot. I don't know. But corner slide it in. That is out to Leo. Gonna control. Oh, that defender just got destroyed. And that's gonna be deflected. That defender just got destroyed. Don't try that on Messi. Don't, don't, don't try it. Another corner lofted in. And that's gonna be cleared out to them. Actually, it is cleared back to us. All right. Let's get one more goal. I want to get one more goal just to seal this. Play. Oh, they should have played it too. Uh, okay, that works. That works. Into Leo. Shot. Leo. Oh, this keeper. He's literally having the game of his life. Corner. Lofted in. And that's going to be... It's going to be right to the greatest player on the planet, their keeper. Oh, that's a mistake. Oh, that's a mistake. Messi. Chip it. Messi. Chip it. Oh, it goes back to the keeper. I should have just shot. He made a horrible mistake. I, I thought we'd have enough chipping there, but maybe we don't. There's going to be a chance like that in this series. Keepers do it all the time, or we're going to chip the keeper that far out. But so that is going to be full time. So at least we won't get knocked out of the Europa League. I mean, that's nice. So 2-1, we scored again, which is beautiful. We win. Can't be too upset about that. We got a chance to win the Europa League. That would be beautiful if we could. But hey, we're playing much better at Dortmund. It's a, it's a beautiful thing to see. All right, so we're going to end the third episode of the Messi player crew mode here. So in the next round, we got PSV in the Europa League. We should match. We should do pretty good in the Europa League. Hey, imagine a Barcelona Dortmund. Europa League final where this alternate universe Messi plays Barcelona that would be hilarious so we're now eight points behind Bayern and we get a chance to catch them although it's very unlikely like I said though he's got to finish second that's the goal but Messi seven goals in 10 games in the Bundesliga see it says we played four Europa League games but that was our first Europa League game so there's like three extra games they're saying we played even though we didn't which is kind of weird and we have an assist maybe we assisted the first goal in the that first leg we simmed maybe i don't know but eight goals so far seven and ten the Bundesliga. we've had a great start to life in germany i mean hey we get in the champions league for next season maybe we stay here at dortmund maybe holland stays and ourselves in holland maybe we try to go for the champions league next season who knows but i think this was a this was a great move for messi at this point in his career and we've had a great start i'm having a lot of fun so hopefully we just keep it up so of course drop a like if you enjoyed let's keep trying to a thousand likes as long as you guys keep dropping likes dropping comments keep supporting the series you will keep seeing it so drop a like the sub button down below we're very close to 50,000 subs it's absolutely insane but we are actually very very close but i will see you guys in the next one hope you have a great day